This is a guide on replacing an LCD screen on an Acer Chromebook model number CB315-3H. For the replacement process, we'll need the following tools, a heat gun, a plastic pick, a metal pick, and one hamster. To begin, turn the laptop off and disconnect the power cord. Start removing the bezel. Using both hands, pull the bezel away from the glass. Start from the left side, then go around the perimeter and snapping the tabs underneath. Separate the hinge cover and remove the bezel. The LCD screen is glued to the plastic cover. We need to use a heat gun to soften the glue. Warm up the left and the right sides of the top cover. Using plastic picks, start separating the LCD screen. Use the heat gun repeatedly on both sides of the laptop to make sure the glue is soft. Use your hand to make sure that the back cover is warm to the touch, but not burning. Use a second plastic pick on the opposite side. Move the plastic picks along the sides of the LCD, separating it from the back cover. Once separation is achieved, place the LCD screen on the keyboard. Use a metal pick to peel off the clear tape securing the video connector. Open the connector's bracket. Disconnect the video cable. Discard the old panel. Take the new LCD screen and place it on the keyboard. Reconnect the video cable. Close the connector's bracket and secure it with clear tape. Caution, it is very important not to force any of the connectors. As well, you must not twist or slant the connector when plugging it in. Lift the screen up. Before we continue, it's better to check if the screen is working. Press the power button and if the startup graphics appear, we can finish the installation process. Turn the laptop off. The LCD screen is held in place with the glue and the bezel. In our case, the original glue is still working and we can proceed with the bezel. But you can use a new adhesive tape, which can be bought from our site, laptopscreen.com. Start replacing the bezel. Press firmly in the bottom corners and then go around the perimeter, snapping the tabs back in place. Use one hand to support the back cover while snapping the tabs along the hinge cover. Close the laptop and make sure that the bezel is in place at the bottom of the screen. Turn the laptop on and we're done.